What's up guys, welcome back. Today we are starting Peaky Blinders. So I don't know much about this show besides like it's about a gang family that lives in England set in like I want to say the 1900s, early 1900s. That's literally all I really know. That and what's it called? I think it was like the main actor and someone else also act in like a good bit of movies together that or I just read that about some other actor and I just thought it was a show but I guess let's get started with the episode I really hope the show doesn't turn out to be boring because I heard a lot of good reviews on the show Everyone's really running from this man. You know, I also heard that it was like somewhat based on a true story, like on a true family or something. Birmingham, England, 1919. Is that kid at the place where they're, like, where they... Is that drugs? Like, I'm just assuming it might be drugs. Fixing races now. Do you have permission from Billy Kimber to be fixing races? Hmm? And what's got into you? You think we can Tommy's the leader, right? Or is it him and, and then it goes to Tommy Please after or something? I'm calling a family council tonight at eight o'clock. I want all of us there. You hear me? There's trouble coming. I don't know if he's going to be there. So he's not the leader yet. Because I'm assuming he's going to be the leader, maybe. So he's investigating into them. Good health to you. Crown of a prince. That dude's haircut is kind of making me mad. Be king, I'd bet. You don't bet. No. List was your name and my name together. What kind of a list would have a name of a communist and a name of a bookmaker side by side? He doesn't seem phased by whatever you're talking about. Perhaps it's a list of men who give fall to. Is that sometimes? My horse stand a chance of winning. Hey! <laughs> hey! Danny, you're a man. Hey! You're not a whiz bang. You're a human being, Danny. You're all right. You're all right. So he was just going through some like PTSD stuff. I was kind of confused for a second. I was like, maybe you should put a bullet in Danny Whiz Bang's head like they do with mad horses. Maybe you'll have to put a bullet in my head someday too. Why is that just like your automatic reaction? 
to pull out a put a bullet in someone's head. Bring the bill to the Peaky Blinders. We'll keep this between ourselves if you swear not to leave guns lying around. Look. What if he can't help it if he's drunk? It might be harder. Now come on, we're late. How do you know so bloody much? Because I asked the coppers on our payroll. And why didn't you tell me? I'm telling you. See, he should already be the leader. There's been all these bloody strikes at the BSA. New Austin works lately. Nothing that's women's business. This whole bloody enterprise was women's business while you boys were away at war. What's changed? We came back. And the Lord will smite the unholy when the great. In the public? Machine guns. 10,000 rounds of ammunition. 50 semi automatic rifles. 200 pistols with shells. Jesus. God damn. Why so many? Sitting right there in Charlie Strong's yard. Dump them somewhere the police can find them. Maybe if they know they haven't fallen into the wrong hands, this might blow over. I don't... I don't think they're... Yeah, I was about to say, I don't think he's gonna do that. Three days until it waits. You have your mother's common sense. But your father's devilment. Oh, no, I still don't think he's gonna do it. Let your mother win. But you love me more than you fear them, right? I don't want to be always sneaking about. Soon. We'll tell them. When? I doubt that. Are we gonna get to see her face? I mean, we'll do this from Galway. You're too pretty. Watch. And listen. I've never heard of someone not getting a job because they're oh, too pretty. In and my own relations have all passed on now like the melting snow. Not that that wasn't good, but it's like, why did you have to sing? In Ireland, my singing made them cry and stop them fighting. Well, I hope you know a lot of songs. I don't trust any of you until you earn my trust. Aren't they just going to tell them so that you're there? Right. I want to blow you up off both of you before they let the ordinary people in. Well, um... Well, that escalated quickly. That's the leader. Myself to you. Understand. In all the world, the only thing that interests me is the truth. So he didn't care about them, like, possibly telling oh, him that they were there, like, he went straight to him. What do you know about the robbery? What's the worst of God? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, he doesn't know, but his, it was his brother that did it, Tommy. We can help each other. Help each other, how? Are you home? 
Because if you're not, you're in the wrong place. Okay, then. He's one of them. Looking for you since he got back from France. Tommy doesn't want anybody at all. Yes, lads. That might change. John wiped the blood out of his eye. I said. I said. We'd have a family meeting. Take a vote. And the only ones I know is him and the mom. I'm assuming that's his mom. Why not? Hmm? Well, he's no truck with feigning. Oh, communist. He's up in the gallery. The boy I love is looking at me. And they all turned away. That sings on the tree. I don't know why I thought he was gonna like start the clap or something. Why do you think that is, Ari? His stare is intimidating, like I'm not gonna lie. What did Tommy say? He didn't say anything. You know what he's like. Yeah, I know what he's like. Likes to take his fights onto the mud. Doesn't like to stand and wait. Wait, is it? Yeah, I was about to say, is that his sister? Like, I didn't recognize her at first, but I thought I saw her before. One day, me and Tommy will be on the same side again. So she's sleeping with the enemy. He's having some PTSD too. I, like it didn't, I didn't think he did, but we were never showed until now. And it's the same dude from earlier. I think it is. He really killed a man. Dig holes. And dig them deep. I want everything accounted for, down to the last bullet. So he doesn't care that there's gonna be possibly murders? Strategy. What so strategy? Take her out to the old tobacco wall. When the boat leaves your yard, it's no longer your concern. Have you lost your fucking mind? Probably. Have you seen the streets? They've sent a fucking army to find these things. That's right. Is it another war you're looking for, Tommy? The tobacco wharf. By order of the Peaky Blinders. Hmm. Are you in possession? I am, sir. First impressions? I'm quite oh. shocked at how these people live. So. She's probably gonna get close to Tommy. Cause I saw the way they looked at each other whenever like they first saw each other. Strikes me that it isn't Arthur who heads the Shelby family. What history? The IRA who murdered my father will not affect my judgment. Who was her father? Is she any clubs? Save you from their barbarity. I said I would dispatch you myself. 
So, like, are you gonna drown them, you know, a quick way? Or shoot them? I died over there anyway, Tommy. I left my fucking brains in the mud. Mm. Those fucking guns. <laughs> it blew God right out of me head. He seems like he's just dozing off into the distance. Is that bad for me? I don't know why I jumped, like literally, I knew it was coming. Don't attempt to wipe the blood off at all. On the magic horse, and that time, when we are ready, the horse will lose. What do you mean, what? How'd they fake that? You did okay, it right Daddy. in front of them. I'm still in shock. You're a picky blinder there, Danny. Hmm. So that's how you become a picky blinder? I thought that was like a family business, not like. Bad week. I really never, I didn't think that she would end up being like undercover and you know, trying to spy on him. So he'd probably never think of it either. Or maybe he's gonna automatically suspect that she is. I don't know, I'm gonna have to see in the further episodes. But this dude, he like he seems like he has no emotions. Like during most of the scenes, I swear he seemed blank faced the whole time. And it, who does it remind me of? The dude from Pride and Prejudice. I swear, whenever I watched that movie and I seen that dude, he had no emotion too. So he remind like that just seems similar to me. But. That episode honestly wasn't bad. I mean, it was kind of boring, but I mean, I feel like first episodes are always boring. So hopefully it'll pick up. But I'm like, so Tommy's really not going to tell his brother, the leader, about like the guns and stuff because he was supposed to like get rid of it or whatever because his mom convinced him to but now he's not so he's he's the rebel he does whatever the fuck he wants and I lucky fuck with it like but yeah I and the dude who actually ended up alive how well, like, they told us how, but it's like still, I thought that man literally died, and then he's not dead, and now he's a picky blinder. But, um, I don't really know what else to expect, so I guess come back for episode two.